My name is Christopher Sheehy. I'm with the Best Recruit Class 101, and my assignment is going to be Churchill Engine 11 C Shift. My name is Muhammad Juma. I'm with Recruit Class 101. I'm assignment 5B. I'm ready to get to work. My name is Brandon Curry, and I am with Recruit Class 101 with Richmond Fire Department, and my next assignment will be Engine 10 C Shift. I came from City of Petersburg Fire Department. I spent eight years there and decided to make the transition up here to Richmond Fire. I've lived in the city since 2007, always considered it my home. I currently live in Churchill, so the, you know there's always a sense of satisfaction getting to serve your city, but now that I'm gonna be stationed at Station 11 in my neighborhood, there's an even greater sense of satisfaction being able to serve you know, the people in your actual neighborhood. I came from the city of Williamsburg. Uh, I was working there for about three years. So the city of Richmond is real diverse, and I feel like with my skill set, like that's that's more for me. But I loved where I was. I love where I am now. I just I'm gonna make the best of wherever I'm at. So it's just an opportunity to grow. I came from the city of Hampton. Uh, I spent 20 years there. Um, left there November 1st of this year and started November 8th uh, with the City of Richmond. I've wanted to be here since 2006, but I, I never really worked out. So I had an opportunity to come uh, this year, this uh, process, and uh, it worked out for me and I, I'm extremely lucky. So uh, all of us were laterals, so we've been through an academy before, but in this academy, we're just learning how Richmond does things their way. It's been a very fast three weeks. It's felt like three months in a way, but only in positive ways where you know all the recruits have bonded great during our time. For the first week, we went through uh, HR, uh, getting paperwork uh, situated. And then week two, uh, we started doing uh, engine company operations, started getting out there into the city, uh, doing some training, uh, high-rise training uh, at the parking garage, and uh, coming back into here, doing some uh, forceful entry training, uh, hose advancements. I love PT, I love like anything that's physically grinding. With the instructors we have, like they make it fun. And like Lieutenant McGee, Lieutenant McCain, uh, Firefighter Jefferson, when they're there, like I, I talk to them, they talk back, like we get hyped up for it, so it's fun. We yeah. do dressing drills, you know, I wasn't the fastest, but we was up there. We were like doing burpees and stuff, lots of burpees. Anything physically exhausting, like you just, you go to work. Anytime we get to go out there as a team, and throw ladders and just do firefighting stuff. That is the highlight of me, that's why we come here, and that's been the best time. On live burn day, we all got mixed up into different groups, so it was kind of like working with a new team. So we really hadn't experienced that before, knowing, you know, just communicating and things like that. And through live burns, you know, between, between being outside truck, inside truck, doing searches, advancing hose line, uh, we were able to bring it all together with a different group of people and it went flawlessly. Coming out and having that sense of relief of knowing, okay, I can, I can do this, I can put everything together that I've been taught in the last three weeks. Things that I was doing in the past were, were definitely a lot more difficult the way that I've been taught and the way that I'm doing things now. The energy is great, like from top down. So that's, that's wonderful. You always love to see that. When the interview, you know, you put on your best foot forward and you tell everybody what you're gonna do. Now it's time to get to work. And like, you just back up what you said in the interview. It's just what these instructors have taught us is to never be complacent, never stop learning, and know your district, and focus on it every day. And I can't see the orange on top of my helmet. All I can see is that I work for Richmond Fire. So it doesn't bother me at all. And you know, when I get the black helmet, well, I've, well I like it, absolutely. But the most important thing is that I'm here now. I wear it with pride. Um, this was a dream. Um, and I will go through all the steps that I have to. 